It's tough because, I mean, being a single parent on one income doesn't give you a lot. I was expecting furniture, but I wasn't expecting how nice my furniture was. I got a bed, mattress, I got a bed frame. How's the couch? Comfortable? I was pretty grateful anyway with what, what they brought me. For the past five years, furniture and donations have been delivered to hundreds of families all over the Lower Mainland. It's an operation conceived by volunteers who recognize the overwhelming need in the community. Everything here goes. We're loading up furniture to be dropped off to some needy families in, in the Lower Mainland. Thank you, kind sir. And how many families have you helped out? Almost 600 now. 600 families, unbelievable, yeah. wow. There's just such a great need out there. The need isn't going away. It seems like it's increasing. We're finding out more and more that there's other families out there who need help. The victims are coming out and actually picking out things that they want, uh, tagging it and putting it in one location in the warehouse so this way we know where it's getting delivered. We heard on the news about the new Westminster fire victims, so we had a whole storage full of furniture and personal things to help the families. Do you want square items? Homer Carpets has been donating its van for about five years and we do like to help out with nonprofit organizations and doing things uh, throughout the community. If you want to donate any furniture or any other nice items, you can contact friends of the family anytime in the near future. I'm Leah Bolton with Joy TV News.